This video is going to go over the basics of creating a vertically compound wall. So a vertically compound wall is a wall that is going to have horizontal elements, either extruded elements or reveal elements that run along the length of the wall. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to find a wall type that we want to do this to. And we're going to edit and duplicate it. And I usually put the word vertical in front of it just so I know that it's a vertically compound wall. You would probably want to be a little bit more descriptive as far as you know what those elements are that's going to be extruded across it, but for now I'll leave this blank. So once we get in here, we're going to want to go into Edit Structure. And these tools down here are the ones we're going to use for a vertically compound wall. And you'll notice they're grayed out. And they will remain that way until we set this to a section view. So there's several things we can do to a vertically compound wall. We can add a sweep, so a solid extrusion. We can add a reveal, a void. We can split the region so that we can assign different materials. Or we can merge regions. So those are the basic things that we can do with a vertically compound wall. And I'm going to go through each of these independently to kind of show you how this process works. 